When you log into my account through the library catalog, you're taken to this page and you may notice um, these tabs here in the lower left hand corner, it says eShelf and queries. Um, your eShelf is what we're going to focus on right now. It's a tab that shows you all of the items from your searches that you have saved to your eShelf that you may want to go back to um, or revisit or cite later on. And how we got um, to this list, how this list was created, was through doing searches. Um, and notice when I click on one, it highlights the information about that highlighted item in the bottom half of the screen. We, we create this list through doing searches in the catalog. So depending on your subject, and I think you can organize them by folders here um, after the fact, kind of like in Zotero, how you have a library you can drag and drop. I think that that's how this functions. Um, but how you get items into this list is by doing a search and scrolling through that search to find your items. Um, you can add the whole page to your eShelf. So all of this 400 and 58 items would show up on your eShelf. And I'm not certain I want that. Um, but if you were to hit the star beside the, the book or item, that would add it as well. So let's go check and see if this mythology by Edith Hamilton is now on my shelf. Um, I'm going to go up to the right hand corner e-shelf. Um, I forget what I'm doing here. And let's just see if mythology is there. Yes, it is. So, so I have quite a few items um, in my basket. So that is one way to manage your research within the catalog. And note that you have to be logged in. I'm already logged in um, to be able to use this function. If I were logged out, I think it would only save it for that session. Like if I starred anything or added it to an e-shelf, that disappears once I'm closed out of the online catalog unless I'm logged in. Check out the other videos on the online catalog um, so that you can search effectively. Thank you.